Sorry, guys, like I said, sometimes this will happen when trying to play the game, but we're good. We're good. We're good. That's a flashlight in my face. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it's a problem with, <laughs> with beta clients and not the most stable of games. That's all right. It's all right. We're good to go. Still wrecking face here. Oh, at least I shot him in the crotch. <laughs> Wrath of pain, indeed. Oh, no! Dang it. Uh, uh, yeah, the commander position, they said that... Th they launched an article about that, or, or a press release about that, and... It's unfortunate. Just like me getting raped right now. I live? That was crazy. Um, yeah, but we'll see. Ain't an expansion they could add it. Oh, dang it, I got taken down by a rocket. the glass get wrecked I need health bad heal 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 Oh, he's still alive. Uh. Dang it. See, the Frostbite 2.0 engine looks incredible. Oh, that's too many of them. What am I doing? Uh. 
Uh, on this map, I believe there are one, two, three, four, five, six. You have two outside the beginning, you have two downstairs, and you have... No, there's eight. We have two upstairs, and uh, the terminal, and then two outside. Oh, good cover, good cover. That music start up, we're low, it's not good. Dang it, we lost. We lost. All right, guys, take a quick commercial while the next map loads. And we're back. It's <laughs> that easy. All right, well, hey, I got third. I got third on attacker, so not bad. 21 kills and 13 deaths. Not a bad score. Did okay, but definitely do better. Um, so I'm going to highlight the shotgun for the assault class, and then we're going to move over into another class. So which class do you guys think I should play? Here's the customization screen. This is really cool. And this is your loadout. Here you can choose your different weapons and the accessories to go with those weapons. Right now I'm using the M416. Accessories. Uh, ACOG. Reflex. Holographic. Night vision. <laughs> rifle scope. Or no optics at all. I'm going with the ACOG right now. There's foregrip, bipod, undersung rail. And then heavy barrel, tactical light, suppressor, and laser sight. No second. Um, let's do underslung. See, if I spawn with the underslung rail, will that spawn the grenades? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Oh, gosh. Uh... All right, well, I can't shotgun very well on this map because of range, so I'm going to go over to Sniper. Customize, Recon, Loadout, SVD, Accessories, into the PSO, because uh, there's no reflection that happens, I believe. Laser Sight, no secondary. I don't need Laser Sight on a Sniper rifle. That gives away my position too easily. All right, so let me get in a good position here. Oh, snap. Gotcha, Kurt. Move, 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 Okay. Drop the radio. That's where I'll spawn at. We have the charge. Over. Dang. Missed. Gotcha. Alright, so I'm on. 
a pretty good position. Not the best, because I can get hit from that side. But I'm able to take out snipers on the left and people advancing on the right. Whoa. Ho, 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 ho. Dang it. <sighs> oh, I have to trade my medkit for the grenade launcher. That makes so much sense. That makes so much sense. Sko Adumer. Thank you. Man, I feel like a noob sometimes when you game. That's even better then, because that would be way too OP for assault to have a medkit and a grenade launcher. No, 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 dang it. Oh, yes, I want to respond. Thank you. Got that sucker. Gotcha. And what's really cool about a recon is I can play uh, without a scope at all. I can take the optics off the gun completely. Even though why you would do that, I'm not totally sure because it's great to have it on a semi automatic rifle. But it works. Moving up. Why I got out of cover, I don't know. Should have kept moving. Backwards. Oh, shoot. Well, I'll have to... Kill that guy. Go, 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 go. Dude, he just disarmed? He disarmed it with the robot? Oh my gosh, that's amazing. That's amazing. <laughs> that is really cool. That is really cool. Dang it. I can't believe you can do that. Oh my gosh. Please, 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 no. Dang it. Dude, that, having that robot do that for an engineer, that's awesome. Okay, now I'm going to switch to shotguns. This could be an indoor, guys. This is not really a good place to snipe. But hey, I was doing some work in sniping, right? All right, so the accessories I have is a reflex sight and an extended mag. That's awesome. And I'm going to save the buckshot. The flechette, I think is what it's called. Um, it's increased, in, increased penetration, but reduced damage potential compared to buckshot. So, stick with the buckshot. Penetration. <laughs> uh, they're going to come down that tunnel. If I can get up close, that'd be great. One's probably going to be coming down the tunnel now. Two tunnels. Uh-oh, 
Oh, I didn't kill that guy? Dang. All right, Mac, thanks for tuning in, buddy. And thanks for your participation in the chat. Really appreciate it. Okay. Let's, uh, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Gotta defend. <laughs> Too far. Too far. All right, <sighs> gotta get closer for that shotgun to work, right? Let's do it. Be advised, enemy sniper has been spotted in your AO. Please proceed. Caution over. Oh, it came from behind. Watch out, watch out, new asshole. Gotcha. Oh, it took too long. Damn. Oof. Be advised. The enemy set the charge. Oh, wow. I didn't even see that guy. You could have lived, buddy. I'm not. <laughs> Dang it. All right, so the shotgun does work. I want to see what a grenade launcher can do. Okay, I think I understand what, how this works then. ammo. 
Hey, guy staring at the wall. I need ammo. Hey, guy staring at the wall. You just got me killed. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that worked very well. Let me try that. Uh, let me get rid of the forward grab and go back to the under barrel. Uh, accessorize under rail sling. Underslung rail. So what's the difference? I get, I can't shoot regular bullets. I didn't kill him. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing with this launcher. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He did have that wall covered. Uh, let me try one more time with this launcher, then I'm I'm going back. I'm gonna try uh, some support. Double kill. I'll take that. Yeah. Dang it. <laughs> yeah, that was totally worth it, man. I'm going to try support now. That's the class I really don't have that much experience with. Uh, Battlefield 3. Let's see here. Ammo box, sprint, black, explosions, cover, ammo. Uh, sure, I'll take ammo. Launch a bipod, which is sweet. Dang it. Shot in the face. Yeah, I haven't really tried out the whole bipod system yet. Um, I need to have a really good placement for it. If I can get in good position. Uh, so it's supposed to reduce recoil. More accurate. Oh, now we are outside. See how I'm by the bipod on the uh, thing there? The lid? Die! To high windows. Too much action there. Come on. Oh, that's not good. I live. I barely live.
tree was asking for. The enemy set the charge. Over. Ah. Come on, where'd that guy go? Oh, there's another one. Nice. Set of ammo. Let her drop some. And no, I can't jump out of the plane and, uh, Parachute or jump out of the plane, jump out of the window and parachute like the other games. Could be, huh? Not in the best positions here. Good. Yeah, moving got me killed. I could just jump out and it would hurt. <laughs> Really? Because I tried it. It didn't work. I didn't mash it hard enough. Nope. No, I fell pretty fast. <laughs> that sucked. Dang it, uh, was, that whole bipod system was weird. Uh. uh, just that one time, Scud, but it stopped, so it's not freezing for me anymore. Ouch. Get wrecked, son. Dang it. I'm liking support. I uh, could use some better submachine guns here. Machine guns. Light machine guns. Let's see. Mission. Jeez. He's, he's planning. I can't shoot him through the bus. This isn't speed. You got him. See how it uh, gets all fuzzy like that? That's that's that suppression. Gosh darn it. F it. I'm jumping and kill these guys. The enemy is set. The charge. You just can't hold sprint and reload. Oh, well, let me jump. Be advised. The enemy has taken the objective. Over. Be advised. Over. He used it good. We only got 23 left. That's a frag grenade. Ow. Ah, I found the little nook where they're spawning from.
Got you! Uh, uh, uh. I can feel his footsteps, or hear his footsteps at least. Oh, jackpot! Dang it! <laughs> uh, the health bar is at the bottom right corner. As soon as I spawn, I'll highlight it to you. Oh, team one. Take a quick commercial break as the next match loads. Play for another about half hour for you guys. Try to detail a little more of the weapons in the classes. Hope you're having fun. It's fun for me. We'll be right back with more shifting gears. <laughs> Just like that. All the ribbons come to me. It's awesome. Well, thank you, Eratatosk. I enjoy playing this game. Try to play pretty good to show you, uh, show you guys a good show here. Like I said, I'll play about for a half hour more and um, call it a night. It's been fun so far. And uh, just shows, you know, Battlefield 3 is really going to be a great title coming out. And um, I think Modern Warfare 3 will be as well. But they are two different style games, really. And um, I have a lot of fun with this one. And I have fun with, you know, Call of Duty as well. So, not to knock either of the games. But I can't wait to fly jets! <laughs> it's going to be awesome. Did I choose Assault again? Support. No, this is support. I have 46 bullets in this magazine. Pop your heads out, you Russians. Come on. Fuckers are all over me! <laughs> I'm coming, bro. a knife kill. What do you guys think? Gotcha! I'm dead, but it was worth it. Dang it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Those are bullets whizzing past my face here. Cover me, guys. Cover. Ah, oh, dang it. Got sniped. Got sniped. That sucks. All right. Spawn on a squad mate here. Spawn on a squad mate that just died. Now I'm dead. <laughs> like shooting fish in a barrel for that guy. You got served indeed. Indeed. All right, deploy. This guy looks like it's safe behind a big rock. Excellent. Move up. Kick my feet over that banister. Banister, railing. Banisters are on stairs. Why did it say banister? Anyway. The chatter in this game is awesome as well. When you spot snipers or something, you're like, I see you, little fella. Stuff like that. It's pretty cool. That's a flashlight. Ah, I can't see. <laughs> Shoot at the pretty lights. OK. 
Okay. Let's see if I can get a flank on some of these guys here. Dang, 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 dang. It. Yeah, I love this cinematic knifing kill as well. It's pretty sweet. Look at that pretty water in the flowers. Isn't that beautiful? What am I doing? <laughs> I'm running past... I'm running past what I have to blow up. I was trying to get a better flank on him, maybe, from behind. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah. PG. I try. Okay. Whoa, look at this guy! Look at this! Look at this guy! Look at this guy! <laughs> that was awesome! That was a bug, but that was awesome. Dang it. A glitch or some of the sweetest dance moves I have ever seen in a video game. That guy was b-boying. The shell. Alright, alright, alright. Cover me. Smoke grenades, anybody. That'd be great right now. So that bullet hit right at my feet. Oh gosh, you still got it for me. All right, we're safe for now. Gotcha, sucker. Oh. Okay. Ah, right, get down. Let's go prone. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> I don't know what that was, but I shot at it just in case. God damn, I've been down. <laughs> that was fun. So like trying to Charlie Chaplin me or something. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Dang it, dude. I thought you were going to cover me. <laughs> oh, that's going to be recorded forever. <laughs> All right. Well, for the last uh, 15, 20 minutes, guys, let's do engineer. Let's blow some stuff up with rockets. Rocket time! For a one reflex site, yes. Back saw repair tool explosives. Get yeah. ready! Here they come! Get ready! Again, I like switching to semi-automatic at range. It's okay. <laughs> that guy. <laughs> oh, betas, aren't they fun? Aren't they fun? Shoot a rocket in frustration. Gah! No, you get to die by a rocket, son. Or from a teammate. Dang it. 
<laughs> uh, clocked. Good question. I don't know how to spot enemies on the PS3. Alright, let me show you the uh, screen here for... Well, usually I win, but we're losing. Uh, only got in the top four. I was having fun, though. Uh, so calculate your points. It's pretty sweet. Usually get a lot more ribbons than that, but uh, goes toward your next next rank there. Uh, Artifact twenty seven. There are some elements from uh, Bad Company two that uh, are there, but the presentation and the unlocking system I feel are better um, because it deals with customization of specific weapons. Not just unlocking a rifle that you'll never use after you unlock it because you want to get the rifle after that. Or the submachine gun, depending on your class. So. But. It's pretty cool. You unfortunately can't hit the escape button until you just deploy uh, to leave the game. Alright, so we are going to stick with Engineer for the rest of tonight's episode. Just to have the feeling of blowing stuff up with rockets. Speaking of rockets, watch this. Ready? Aim. Fire. <laughs> I'm a wizard. Need to get to that concrete cover. Stay on target. Nice. All right, we're good. Not anymore. I got sniped from the right. That sucked. Those rockets do not do anything. They're just for atmosphere. Yet. Maybe that's how a... Uh, Sam site works for anti-aircraft. Not sure. But they look cool. And you see planes over there flying a the distance. Oh, by the way, this is the Eiffel Tower. That's a lot of smoke because something's burning. It's pretty cool. Look at the buildings, too. It's like we're in a big park. Big park, you know, just, just taking cover. Killing enemies. I haven't unlocked the robot yet. Be advised, the enemy what? Set the charge over. Be advised, we have defused the charge. Over. Where'd that guy go? That was weird. Uh, most effective gun is one of my assault rifles for sure. As far as the, the range, the accuracy, and the damage. That's one of ours. You can blow those up through the enemy and you get points for 120 points for blowing it up. Destroying enemy equipment. Hi yo. Let's really piss somebody off. Let's kill him with a rocket. Come here. Come here. Oh, I heard him. Didn't kill him though. Dang it! I almost had him. Uh, correct, clock 555. If they're spotted, they will pop up on the radar. Um, possible if they shoot, they'll pop up on the radar, but I can't confirm because I haven't noticed that yet. Somebody in the chat may uh, be able to confirm that. Be advised, we've spotted an enemy. 
Enemy sniper in your area. Over. I wish it was actual Russian voices and it was subtitle dialogue. Because, hey, what better way to learn a foreign language than to learn grenade, there's a sniper, and get down, or F them up. Oh, 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 stay down. It's running on the open for fun here. I need to be smarter. And I'm taking pot shots. Rocket time. Rocket man! That was my spot indicator telling me there's nothing to spot. Uh, I aimed way too high. <laughs> Um, Craft 13. Uh, not sure. Possible. I've not checked that in the options. I just haven't noticed it when I've gone into the options. Alright, so we're just in defense mode here. Gotta get a sweet rocket kill. Come on. Look at that arc. Come on, baby. Oh, watch this. Let me find a tree. See that tree right there? See how it shook? When I shot him with a rocket? Wasn't that cool? Let's try it again. Mmm, shaking the leaves. Some of these trees you uh, can snap in half with the rockets and stuff. Like that one. Oof, it flew. Now I got a little bit more cover. <laughs> nice. Hey, D! Good day, Josh! Ah. Dang it. The enemy set the charge. Over. Hey, D! Yes! <laughs> I'll take it. That was aces. Hey, D! Go, 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 go. Get out of the way, park bench. I need ammo. I need ammo bad. Ammo, guys? Ammo? No? Favorite class so far is Assault. Oh, dang. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. At least I got that really cool rocket kill. All right, I'm going to switch over to my favorite class, Assault, with my favorite loadout. Accessorize, foregrip, heavy barrel, back, medic kit, fibrillator, sprint. Here we go. Time to wreck some face. Whoa! That rocket was loud. Enemy sniper spot. 
sniper in your AO. Proceed with caution. Over. Be advised, we spotted a hey! hostile soldier in your area. Dog. Proceed with caution. Over. Oh, come on, go over it. Thank you. Red kid here. So went to the rock. Come on, where are they? There they are. You hear that sound? That's the sound of victory. Hey! Yeah! That was fun. <laughs> Alright guys, we're in quick commercial. We'll do a little recap of uh, Battlefield 3 beta. And then I'll sign off. So, I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back. Well, I hope you really enjoyed this episode of Shifting Gears going over, you know, Call of Duty, Battlefield. Yes, they are competition to each other, but they both have incredible strengths and different play styles and gameplay mechanics that we both can enjoy as gamers. And even though um, the Call of Duty franchise is really strong in the pro circuit of MLG, it doesn't mean that Battlefield itself doesn't have a place in esports um, in general. Uh, like I've said, there are tournaments. I think one is uh, coming up for $1.6 million for Battlefield 3. So the competition element is there. Um, however, as a spectator eSport, it is more difficult to watch such a large based map style game with vehicles and infantry and up to 64 players at once compared to the tighter uh, Call of Duty format. I am not saying that Battlefield is not as good as Call of Duty or, 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 either, or vice versa. I'm just saying that they are both great games in their own elements, and I am so stoked for Battlefield 3 coming out in October. Um, really looking forward to it. I will be streaming more of the beta on my off hours at twitch.tv slash clutch08, and hopefully unlocking more of the different um, weapons for the different classes that we have. And then uh, when the full game comes out in October, I mean, we'll see a lot of uh, a lot of really sweet content coming out for it, and especially some jet flying awesomeness. Uh, so, any final questions from you guys, real quick? Got a couple minutes. Go and fire away. I got the chat screen right there. Um, I know one person had asked uh, for the PS3 how to how to um, spot enemies. It was the select button. Somebody had answered that. I am not Ray Romano. <laughs> uh, 
If I was, I would have a lot of money. Yes, uh, you can take the sniper scope off the recon weapon. It can be just a regular semi-automatic rifle using the iron sights, which is pretty cool. It just shows how much customization you can have within the game. Um, you can also follow me on Twitter at Clutch08. Oh, I have my cap, caps on. That was weird. <laughs> Clutch08. And next week, I plan to have two of the casters, if any of you are StarCraft II fans, which I'm sure a lot of you are. Uh, if you haven't heard, for our gold members... There will be two extra streams of StarCraft II during MLG Orlando. And we will have four casters from the community that have been pumping out a lot of awesome VODs for replays of uh, Raleigh and Anaheim. And those casters are Adebisi, Nursky, Toomba, and Robin. And next week, I believe I will have two of those casters with me on Shifting Gears to talk over the wonderful world of casting StarCraft II and getting really pumped for MLG Orlando. Um, how does it feel compared to Bad Company 2 or Battlefield 2? Uh, it feels like a marriage of both, and it highlights or, or incorporates the best of both of them. Uh, for the Frostbite engine being updated from the Bad Company series, and the class system pretty much feels the same in both the games. Um, but uh, I believe once we get into vehicles that will really, really start moving into what made Battlefield 2 so great, um, especially with the corporation of jets. Can't wait. Favorite part of the map? Uh, man. I would say the beginning part because I felt I had some really good positioning in some areas of the map um, for long-range assault uh, sniping or just regular sniping. But being in the subway and using the shotgun uh, was a lot of fun as well. So, all right, guys. Looks like it's all the questions I see so far. So be sure to tune in next week, same time, 10 p.m. Eastern, right here on MLG TV. And uh, if they have any questions, go ahead and send them on Twitter. I'll try to answer them as soon as I can. So once again, thank you so much for tuning in to Shifting Gears. I'm your host, Clutch. And be sure to check out my footage of Diablo 3 Beta as well. See you guys later.